Are you V? Please, step in the vehicle. Okay. Hello, V. I'm Jefferson Perales. You've already spoken with Elizabeth, my wife. Nice to meet you, Mr. Perales. Mrs. Perales. Hmm, right again, Liz. You see, my wife is a great judge of character. Said this would work. Now I see why. So, what do you got for me? Carter, let's go. Elizabeth? Well, as you're probably aware, Mayor Lucius Rhine recently passed. We want to know how, why, whatever else is pertinent. It was all over the news. Of course it was. Media feasted for weeks. Pieces like that are their lifeblood. Right. Think they missed something? We have reason to believe they did, yes. As far as I know, case is closed already. It is. Of course, the police wrote it off as natural causes. Ryan passed at home due to a cardio implant malfunction. But we're left wondering about the cyber psycho attack at City Hall a few days earlier. The police say it was completely unrelated. What makes you think the cops got it wrong? Got any evidence? Shortly before Ryan passed, he made cuts in the NCPD budget. Perhaps got on someone's bad side that way. In any case, we have the cyber psycho attack on a BD. Our chief of security scanned it, but didn't find anything out of the ordinary, so to speak. We need a brain dance editor, a real one. It's raw footage. The brain dance. It has to be back where it belongs today, or a lot of people will be in a lot of trouble. If you agree to help, you can see it right now. All right. See what I can do. Excellent. We'd be happy with any fine that would clarify things. Alleviate lingering doubts. Well, what do we got here? Question is, what are you doing here? My brain too, isn't it? And this time, don't go scrolling every ass you see. Eyes on the mayor. Stuff belongs to City Hall. Let's make it PG. Who's the Hulk guy? No idea. Those ass clowns are all the same. Second conference in three days. No idea what this blitz is for. That's why I'm mayor and you're not. Now's when we need the visibility. You're spreading yourself too thin. I'll rest tonight. My room at the Red Queen's race is ready. Yes, of course. Good. Now go. Out of practice. Red Queen's race. Cause any inner synapse apps? Sure, bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting off with their heads. You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. left literally seconds before the attack. It looks planned, like it was done on purpose. That or the psycho saw his chance and took it. Don't get paranoid on me. Hold it! Stop right there!
Slow your roll. Re reward, NCPD. Police. Let him in? Let him wait. It's important. Gotta speak to the mayor's chief of security. Prem, do it after. The conference. crashed right as he went through the gate. Yeah, glitch is no accident. Nah, seen stranger coincidences. Like? Like when you bang some chick and then her sister, later, same night. And it turns out they're both sisters of God. That really happened to you? Nah, but it could've. Do it after the conference. Probably that he was standing by to lick Ryan's butt. The tune. Don't recognize it. Tune. What he's humming. Wouldn't call that a tune. He's really into it. Could have called that the city with what he was packing. Probably what happened. He disappeared from the moon, sight unseen. And then some pig got himself a new set of wheels and an ugly ass suit. Know that? We're just talking out your ass again. Once you've seen all I've seen, don't need to know things to know them. People are the same everywhere. Okay, it's coming out your ass. Well, well, well. See anything suspicious? Rather not jump to any conclusions. There's not much to go on. Still too early to say. Sure, sure. Any questions at this point? Ray Queen's race. What is it? Got me. Never heard of it. Sorry. Who's Holt? Ryan's deputy. And his conference. Why was it held? For no particular reason. As far as I recall. <laughs> Sorry. Ryan reclassified Pacifica an independent. <laughs> Clever. Cop who saved Ryan. Know anything about him? Detective River Ward. Good guy. We worked a few cases together. You want to talk to him? I'll put you in touch. Sheesh, Ward had great time. Either has crazy good luck or had a source. Got good info. Well said. Sending you his deeds. If you need anything else, let us know. We'll help. Name's V. Looking into the death of one Lucius Ryan. Wonder why you're not a cop. Jefferson and Elizabeth Perales hired me to do it. Presumptive mayor sniffing around his predecessor's untimely death. Interesting. Done some digging, got more intel. Also interesting. All right. I'm headed to Chubby Buffaloes. Be their stat. The cult hit musical Corporate Wars is back in theaters and...
Someone here to see you, looks like. Huh. Wonder what about. Wanted to talk. You got a minute? You must be V. Partner, Detective Hahn. Mind if we step off to the side? Hahn and me, we're like one mind. Got no secrets. You really intend to work with a merc? I don't know what I intend just yet. I'm now gonna see if I hear anything new about Ryan's death. You back on that? Boss Ori? And if you couldn't give a rat's fat ass about any of that, he'd mind. See me do anything? Just sitting here, sipping coffee, listening to gossip. Fine. Do what you want. I'm not about to be part of this. Gotta go get my little girl anyway. And you two at least find a quieter corner? Wouldn't want to be overheard. Okay. Talk. I see Detective Hahn's not a fan of edge runners. Don't take it personally. Detective Hahn's not a fan of anybody, except his daughter. You wanted to talk? Before the attack, you wanted to talk to Ryan's hustle. Get some info, dude. What was it? You know what? Hahn was right. Acoustics are a little too good in here. Got my car outside. Okay, sure. Some of the boys from the precinct saw Horvath around Arroyo, shooting up dumpsters, hollering how he's got to meet with the mayor. Brought him in. Brought who in? Peter Horvath. Cyber psycho who attacked the mayor later. They took him downtown, but then he got lost before they could get his statement. So you saw him as a potential threat, decided to warn the mayor. Just like that. Because he got a good heart. Make it sound like that's something to be ashamed of. Ashamed? Nah. Just not something you see every day. Said he got lost. How's that happen? What's it mean? It means someone didn't want him counting roaches in a cell that day. And before you ask me, no. I got no idea who. My turn. Why is Perales looking at this now? Why does he want it done unofficial on the hush hush? Red Queen's race. Heard anything about it? Know what it is? Maybe I have. Maybe I do. It got anything to do with Ryan? The guy was headed there the day he died. <sighs> Fine. We're gonna see my CI. All I've heard is some fancy-ass club. No idea where to even look for it. CI might know. Then we'll go talk to the woman Horvath worked for. Or actually, we could see her first. Up to you. Let's go see your informer. Club's a better lead. Fine with me. My guy works here. You go talk to him. I'll wait outside. Tell him Igor says hi. He'll know what it's about. All right, wait here then. Sorry, sorry! You're looking for uh, general inspiration or something specific? Because I can help with both. Looking for a club. Red Queen's race? If I... Want an address. Look, club's invitation only, right? You don't know the address. It means you're not welcome. Igor says hi. Fuck, no. Said I was done. I was out. Leave me the fuck alone, all of you.
this off. Relax. Just got one question to ask you. <laughs> Nothing to see here, sir. No, no, really. Come on, ghost, I said. Leave me alone, got it? Can't make me do a damn thing. We can, actually, and we will. Just tell us where to find Red Queen's race. I don't know! So fucking remember. And make it quick. All right! Jesus! Chill, okay? It's outside city limits. Near the river. Benita Street area. You been there? Not telling you another fucking thing. Kiss my ass. Both of you. Well, well. That's what I call a breakthrough. It seems promising, but I'd still hit that market. Market? Morvoth's employer, one I mentioned before. I just wouldn't let that lead drop. Okay. Let's go see this market of yours. We're gonna take my car? Sure. Thanks. of any detective's job is talking. How about we change tacks this time? Ask questions first, then level threats. So, who are we supposed to talk to? CyberCycle's boss, you said? Christine Markov, 42. File has her as Horvath's sole employer. Sole contact, too, actually. Come on, V. Start from the left, you take the right. Christine Markov, Noor, has a stall here. Don't know any Christine. This isn't BD Heads Anonymous. Christine Markov. No, but I know who she is. Stand with the pen over on the other side. You, Christine Markov, we have some questions. You badges? Looking for data on Pater Horvath. Worked here, apparently. Yeah, he did. Then he stopped working, started making fucking speeches all the time. Horvath make good scratch here. Could have bought this whole market with the chrome he was packing. So where do you get the Eddies? Know anything? Look, if I knew, I wouldn't be here selling scop to... Peter showed up one day with all that. Extra worked up, too. And then he launched right into one of his type... These, uh, speeches. What did he have to say? Ryan, a corpse got him by the balls and cock, but he... Why'd he have it in for the mayor? Ha! <laughs> Looking for reason in that whack job? Probably thought Ryan was talking to him through the TV from... Look, I told you what I think. In Horvath's world, everybody was out to get him. Lucian... Had no other connection, those two. Think hard. Easy money? That's what... Worked for normals, not so normals. Would that be all, detectives? You're spooking my clientele. Somebody'd finally seen what he was worth. 
Horvath had sponsors. We might have guessed as much. Might seem like we didn't get a lot out of that. Sometimes intel makes sense once you've got some context. Say, for instance, minor detail means nothing, right? Usually, sure. But then the guy waltzes straight into oncoming traffic. Accident? Coincidence? Or maybe air-dispersed poison? A deliberate hit. You actually caught a case like that? No. Made it up. Still proves my point. Pig wagon. Oh, great. Let me handle this, V. Step aside, Lug. Your boyfriend got sent up for years. Doubt you want the same. Hey, gentlemen, gentlemen, chill. Please. <laughs> Jump, clown! Jump! Walking the streets with you? Downright unsafe. Got a beef with all gangs or just the tigers? I'm a cop. What do you think? Uh... Okay. Red Queen's race now. First, I gotta cl We'll meet there. Want to make it to the top? Guard your ascent from the penthouse. Charge the hill. Well, hey. This is animal turf. I can see that. Lock up any of theirs recently? Not lately, no. But they're not big fans of pigs, either. I can't go in without a warrant. But you... Uh-huh. All right. Be in touch. You find anything, tell me. Fuck off! Nothing to see here. I'm looking for a club. Red Queen's Race. Closed. Not opening anytime soon either. 
So it's fine if I have a look around inside. No, it ain't. No looking. Just delta the fuck out of here. Now you're cut. like a normal body shop to me. Club's here. I'm telling you. Tell him you got a hunch? Cop intuition? Something like that. Cover up. Whatever it was that went down. What should we be looking for? Let's try to find something that looks like an office. Every club has one.
Ah. Shit. V, you okay? My. V, come on. You hear me? Breathe. Ah. Oh. You asked me. One heart attack to As I said from... Someone spiked his BD. That... Fuck. Think you could be right? Come on, V. Looks like an office. Sort of. Comps are what we want. Comps above all. Yep. Stiff as a board. You ask me, he's been dead at least an hour. No. No trauma cut. Pretty sure he didn't bring it on purpose. A uh, club like this, you don't want TT banging down the door when you're banging away and things start to heat up. Okay. Boys are getting him out of here. Of course, nobody will see him. No way. Yep. Yes. Weird. Guy looks familiar, doesn't he? V, I'm not in the mood for jokes. Think we've seen everything we needed to. Okay, let's Delta. Think I saw another way out on the way in. Still hanging around with this punk? Shut it, Harold. I know what you did. Not about to ask why you covered it up. Not even why you jumped into this mess to begin with. Just wanna know. What's the matter, River? Why do you even care? Your conscience is clear. You can sleep tight at night. You know why? Because I took all the responsibility. You got no idea how this city works. Hey, don't look at me that way, Merc. You know I'm right. Hey, don't drag me into this. I don't do politics or NCPD and her squabbles. Yeah, so what do you do? Looking for a path and plate. Don't know fuck all about me. Don't even try and guess what I'm about. Didn't mean no offense. V, appreciate the help, but this isn't your biz. I'll take care of it. How you gonna do that? Am I under arrest? Got a scroll, got a motive, got your confession. So yeah, you could be. But it wouldn't make much sense. You don't even gotta say who ordered you to go and clean up. I know anyway. So, since even our brass's fingers are all over this, I gotta take it to internal. They won't do a thing either. Not to me. Just go home, Ward. Get some sleep. Find all this easier to take in in the morning. I mean, that's my plan. Fuck. <sighs> so, what now? Won't let this go. Can't. Holt murdered Ryan. Wanted his seat. Oldest, tritest motive in the book. That's why I believe it. Use the NCPD to cover his tracks. Also think it was Holt. Only one who stood to gain. Ticking this to inter- Got enough to get this case reopened. Do it. And you? Gonna report back to the paralysis? Yep. Okay. I'm gonna stay. Observe a little.
So, about Ryan. Got a pretty good idea what happened. Great. Come by, please. It's a sensitive matter. I'd rather discuss it face to face. We'll be waiting. Thanks. Just gonna tell you one thing. I'm listening. Don't tell him nothing. Don't get involved. This muck is deeper than you think. Suck you in if you're not careful. I'm always careful. Fine, do whatever the fuck you want. Not like you listen anyway. Hello, V. Please, come in. Make yourself at home. Jefferson will join us shortly. Please, have a seat. Thank you. Good to see you, V. Elizabeth tells me you have answers for us. I'm all ears. Case is pretty complex. Leaves a lot of questions unanswered. I'd rather not draw any conclusions yet. But you must have an opinion. Jeff, honey, read between the lines. The case is complicated, but dying at home of a cardiac malfunction, that's not complicated. So we were right? Yes, and that's enough for me. We have to be careful. Very careful, Jeff. That's what V's trying to tell us. Thanks for your help, V. Your fee. You two watch out for each other. Hey there. Now, where did we leave off? Right. We'll return to this place. 